Driver is facing an attempted murder charge after police say he intentionally rammed a person on the Santa Monica Pier early this morning. And that's not all. That driver also crashed into a popular restaurant. CBS 2's Cara Finstrom is live in Santa Monica with the latest. Cara? Yeah, fortunately that man is okay, but police saying they went after that attempted murder charge because they think this was very intentional. They say the driver had to zigzag his way in, going around this boat barrier and then those metal poles before getting to the restaurant. They're angry. Obviously, they're very angry. Blade Linden says he was doing construction work outside the Bubba Gump restaurant on the Santa Monica Pier when an enraged man drove his car right at him. They struck me with the car, flew on top of the windshield, and rolled off the car, and turned around, and hit the, the Bubba Gump uh, boat, or whatever, and it ran into a railing. And uh, pretty much they just took me out. The restaurant, which was damaged, is in an area of the famed pier where the public is not allowed to drive. Police believe the driver intentionally maneuvered around metal poles to get to it. Why? They think he was angry about an earlier confrontation. Got him in a full Nelson. Another construction worker shared this cell phone video shot hours earlier. He says it shows a struggle that involved the driver and two other people who had also fought with him. Police think the driver left in a taxi or Uber, then came back walking onto the pier to get his car. At that point, they think he went after the construction workers with his car. It ultimately stopped after also plowing into a railing. I chased them down and they got stuck right here. Police say they've arrested the man they believe was behind the wheel, 21 year old Daniel Arroyos, and he will face charges of DUI and attempted murder. Lyndon's friend bandaged his leg. Lyndon tells us he's okay, but for a few moments, feared for his life. It hurts my legs pretty busted up, but I'm, I'm doing okay. I'm just glad to be alive. And you're taking a live look here at some damage to that wooden boat barrier. Apparently, that car backed up as it tried to get away and smashed into it. We did speak with a representative from the pier. He says they will be taking a closer look at all of this to see if any additional safety measures might be needed. Wow. Jeff Sharon, one other point. Uh, police tell us they're looking into whether there was anyone else in that car with the man who might also face charges.